Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 12, and this is war number 5. And we're going up against an alliance called Fantastic Four Players. Now, we fought them before, and I know they're pretty good fighters. So we are going to go for the win. We need to try and get this win so that we can hit Platinum once again. That is our goal for this season. Platinum 4, Platinum 3... We just need to be back in Platinum. Alright, so as is pretty common, no defender on that first node there on Path 1, which is the path I take in Section 1. And this is the Starburst path. And we also have Limber. Now, I was a little nervous about this fight because I still don't know enough about Ebony Maw. I don't know how to fight him. So the only thing that I do when I fight Ebony Maw is one be thankful that i didn't bring ghost or corvus and two throw heavies to break his focus i don't know when i need to throw the heavy uh i don't know how many of those little counters that i see on me uh before i can uh before i need to throw the heavy because he will get to a point where all your attacks are just missing i didn't want it to get that far so what i do is I just try to fire off heavies, as you see there, frequently. That way, I figure I don't have to worry too much about it. Now, I got nervous when I saw that mission completed, um, but I kept going. Uh, as you can see here, we're not doing too badly. As soon as I could, I went and fired off another heavy, just in case. And here we go. And down goes Ebony Maw. So, not a difficult fight, but it does make me nervous. Uh, I do need to learn a little bit more about him so I can know exactly when I need to do that instead of just doing it every chance I get. But that's our path in Section 1. And when I came back, they had cleared, and we're ready for Section 2. Now, in Section 2, I take Path 2. Uh, and that happened because, of course, I clicked... Uh, trying to move and clicked on the profile instead that happens too often uh, but so one of my alliance mates was asking me which path I wanted to take here uh, they took path one now if you saw path three was actually the easier path but when I scouted I planned to take path two I saw kingpin and I saw killmonger and that's why I brought the team that I did. I brought in Medusa, and I brought in Captain America Infinity War. With a Cosmic on the team, Captain America Infinity War does a armor break on parry. So that's perfect for fighting Killmonger. But first, we got to get through this Kingpin. Now, anytime I see Kingpin, I think of my Spider-Man Stark Enhanced, who I usually bring to war. But because of that Killmonger, I decided to switch the team up a little bit, bring in Medusa, because she can also take that Killmonger. Now, if you watched, um, I believe it was War Number 3, you'll see that I got completely wrecked on Path 1 using Medusa. But that's because of the node. Killmonger... Easy to take down with Medusa or Captain America Infinity War, but it was the node that caused me so much difficulty. With Kingpin, as you see here, it's a matter of baiting out that special one. Don't get hit by his heavy. That has wrecked me more than once because he does go unstoppable. All right, so we got him down, and now we've got that Killmonger. And he was the reason that I chose this path. After getting beat down by that Killmonger on path one in section two, I needed to get a little something something back. All right, so I made sure I came in here after this Killmonger. So fighting him, not that difficult. You see right there, already put an armor break on him, okay? We get to that special two. Now we just need to bait that out. No problem. Just keep going in. And pretty much parry to get the armor break like that. 
so that we're not dealing with that reverberation. And that's it. Bait out the specials. I don't like his special one so much. But Captain America Infinity War has a high block proficiency, so I can block all of those and not have too much of a problem. And down goes Killmonger. Just that easy. Kind of wish I had him uh, for that path when I was uh, taking it before. Uh, I could have brought in Starkey, so we would have had a Petrify and might have done much better. But that's okay. We got our path down. Now, that was the last of those. At this point, we're about to fight the boss. You can see that the boss is almost down. And we're pretty sure we've won this one. There's no attack bonus left. And so what you're seeing here is me not really caring. I'm not fighting the way you should fight. You see how I'm firing off mediums? So I'm taking damage back, but I don't care because I'm just trying to do as much damage as possible. All of us are gonna have our round in, okay? So as long as I can evade his special one, and his special two, that's it. So all I was trying to do was pretty much get to my special two. Boom. All I wanted was that special two. It could have done a whole lot more, but it is what it is. All right. Um, sometimes you get that crit, sometimes you don't. Now, I really need to practice fighting Killmonger. I really, really do. Um, one of the things that I need to fight uh, or to practice uh, fighting with him is to do the uh, light attack intercepts. I'm used to fighting him with Havoc. So I don't really have to worry about all of that. I've never needed to practice it, but that's what I really need to do. All right, so you see somebody else went in. Here we go. And we're going in, last one, hopefully, we're gonna be able to finish him off. So my goal here is very similar to what I was doing before. Not worrying about the medium attack, damage back, not trying to do light intercepts, just trying to shatter that shield, build up to a special two, and get him with that special two. That's pretty much it, that's my goal. All right, so here, I knew I wasn't gonna be able to get the special two before he got his rock shield back, all right, so we got to get it down again. Here we go. We just need a few more. It's shattered. I don't want to go to my special three. There we go. Thought that was going to finish him, but it didn't. So now we got to evade that special one again, and we took him down. All right, so that was it for that fight. Boss down. So all that's left is to find out how we did in this war. All right, we've got 30 seconds left to find out how we did in this war. I'm pretty sure we won this one. We got uh, full clears, and we're pretty far ahead in terms of uh, deaths. So this should be a win, but let's find out for sure. Less than 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, how did we do? All right, go to the history. And as you can see, we won. All right, so that's gonna do it guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.